that's the worst. I'm crazy. I also just noticed I still had pre-show named on the title. God damn it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this has just been your day, hasn't it? This has been your day, man. I'm so okay. sorry. So Golden. apparently I'm never allowed to cook again because once I do that, every you, bad you, thing you in the planet just happens. <laughs> okay, Golden, I've got a remedy to fix, to help cheer you up at least. It's not Dan's. He got you. <gasps> he got you. <laughs> Because oh, Brent yeah. needs a dose of cuteness, I will. You're okay, Golden Fox. You okay, Golden Fox? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Nicole, Nicole, Golden Fox needs huh? a really big hug from you. Did you hear her, Dan? He, she said, this is like Babe, the come here and say that. Pause and come back here. Up. <laughs> Okay. okay. This is like the inspirational you guys for anime with scene this that everyone day day has. Also, I'm what? so sorry for the lost project, oh, Mr. Golden Fox. What happened? Jesus Christ, that is a big text, but I got a $200 uh, donation. What? Oh, wow. So, you know, so, Bliss, Who? you know what this means? What? 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 Tetris 2. Oh, oh, you no. son of a crock! <laughs> okay, um, if y'all if y'all want to hear a really bad joke, just for context, Chris is playing Se uh, Charky's playing Sekiro, and he said this to me a second ago. Um, the game has an enemy that is a giant black rooster, and and they are hostile, so you have to murder them. And I told her I was going to penetrate a large black cup. So wait, what game oh, is he playing? God. Just so you know, uh, I'm only judging you on the outside and the inside. <laughs> I love him, and I'm going to... <laughs> so, what game was he playing? Sekiro. I okay. want the girl! I want the girl! I want to make cookies with the girl! She would love that. Oh, oh, we make cookies all day! Okay. So, from my perspective, what happened hey, is honey. I left in the middle of this and was like, huh, I'm kind of hungry. I want to throw and something we'll together stuff. and eat it. It'll be fun. And fucking, as soon as I come back, everything is on fire. And, 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 then, and then I will introduce her to my nieces and nephews, and she'll ha get to have a play date. <laughs> Morty. Boy wants to know who the giggling child is. That's my daughter. <laughs> yeah. Say hi Jessie to Jasper. Jasper. She is your adorable. Wait a yes, minute. Yes. I just realized something. Hmm. What? Hang on. I'm going to do a little test run here. Hang on. Okay. I'm hanging on to something. Hang on to something! I'm holding, holding on to the Holding on. Desk. Holding on. <laughs> I am holding on to air. Okay. I'm going to do a little <laughs> test run. So, yes, Jasper, that is my daughter you're hearing in the background. <laughs> it's a cute that? four year old little girl. <laughs> And she is booping my nose. I want the girl. <laughs> Give me the girl. <laughs> well, Blissy, Blissy, we, yes. if you, we could do a hangout time. You just gotta come over. You're in Dallas. I just I'm got not. back from Dallas. I'm I just, not in Dallas. Okay. I'm in her. So I just found out why uh, the game was lagging like shit. Uh -oh. But, Okay, so in OBS, there's a number of things that are active in the OBS. Um, I had a good number of uh, emulators that are captured and directed to the screen. A lot of them were technically active. Yes. So it was using up some CPU. That's why it was lagging so horribly. Oh. No more climbing on top of mommy like a monkey. Stop climbing on me. Because now like I'm just playing it through child. like nothing. You know what I? You know what I do with climbing children? You know what I do with climbing children? <laughs> I grab them by one hand and by one foot, and then I dangle them up in the air. They love it. <laughs> well, I can't do that with my kid because I am not physically strong enough to do that. I'm shocked that I can still do it. Okay. What? Stop. Get my this. What's wrong with monkey Honey. business? 
I will hug her stop. and squeeze her and feed wow. her and love her. <laughs> Honey, stop trying to stretch out my shirt. He's pulling. Oh, don't stress shirt. out! Don't stretch out the mama shirt. Don't do that. Oh no! Especially since this is a video. This is from a video game franchise. This that I got. Okay, honey, calm down, Miss Hyperactive. Where did this suddenly come from? Where did the sugar come from? Did you give her sugar? Probably. No! No, I actually, I did not. The only thing that she had that sweet was an orange. A sip of uh. orange. Y'all right. need to go to dance. <laughs> oh, I got something a little better. Huh. Here, there's something that'll make me feel better. What? What? What did Wait you just for it? What did you? Oh, what? We're waiting for it. <gasps> <laughs> what did you do? What did he do? I've I've lost. What did he do? Look on the screen. Oh. Son of a basket in the forest on Sunday night. Oh my god! I swear to God, you better not suck. Kinky. I swear to God, if you suck, if you suck intentionally, Golden. Ooh. You've been warned. Ah shit. Actually, not anymore. Jasper, she ran off. Don't worry. And my headsets are on, so she can't hear me. And you screwed up. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. No, Here comes. No. He does this on purpose. He does this on purpose. <laughs> he does this on freaking purpose. <laughs> I when you have reactions I like that, yeah. motivate him in such a manner. <laughs> Gee, don't you just hate when people intentionally do stuff to make you burst the gasket? Says me every review is web episode ever! <laughs> Jasper! Magical Star! Magical Star is right on one thing. Golden Blissey is going to kill you at BrodyCon. Oh, It'll he knows be... it. It'll be worth it. <laughs> oh, the hell? Well, you're it. not getting any peanut butter blossoms from me. Oh, yeah. I'm willingly. Oh, ouch. I'm gonna make it for BrodyCon. I'm gonna put him in my luggage. You're not getting any. Oh, God. Not willingly. I was good Uncle Ken's eyes as Penis Blossom. Penis <laughs> Blossom, did you say? <laughs> what the dick did you just say? <laughs> I mean, I heard it too. <laughs> Kaboom. <laughs> First there was the penis flag trap, now there's penis blossoms, so, you know. What the hell? Hey, actually, I got an idea. We're getting close to 400. Um, how would you guys like an extra milestone added in there for 400? Sure. Uh, like what? What are you gonna do? Well, I don't have an ideal game, per se, but let's let the chat uh, share some ideas. And keep in mind... Pokemon it, Mystery Dungeon! It has to be... It has to be <laughs> kept in a retro perspective. Ellie. Ah! Wait, how, how would y'all do that? Well, I, I'm... I'm. What do you mean, how would I do that? I mean, just retro games only. Oh, no, I mean, Ellie threw out the idea of you and her, like, in Tetris. And I'm like, wait, how would that work? Pokemon it, Puzzle? It wait, is that actually a thing? Pokemon Puzzle? I don't think that it is. It yeah, is, it is, actually. I remember oh. that game. It's Pokemon Tetris, Dirt. literally. <laughs> or no, it no, it's, is. It's, it's, it's Pokemon Bejeweled. <laughs> what the fuck are my neighbors upstairs doing? I'm sorry, there was just fucking? a oh, they're fucking walking over my head. What? They, my fucking neighbors upstairs, it doesn't... It, it seems like it's especially when it's late. They start fucking... Bumping around like motherfucking woolly mammoth. Oh my god. Well, I'm pretty sure. Crazy. And these are the same fucking people who will come to our apartment and be like, You guys are loud. Can you quiet down? Fuck right the fuck off into next motherfucking Tuesday, oh you hypocritical cunt. I think what? the favorite oh, word that I can feel her. Is probably the activity that they're participating in that's causing them to be so loud. I can feel the heat in my headsets. 
can feel the heat from Guys, Ellie from, in I, my headset. I told you, I can't do uh, in 64. Yeah. Yeah, uh -huh. I said, ret okay, like, okay, uh, let me try to pinpoint, I'm going to type it down. What's the most recent console By the way, that Golden, you can do? Did you not want to have post show up still, or, because it's still up? It's still going. Um, right now I'd have, okay. I'm, I'm currently uh, taking care of, uh, let's see. Itchy knows. <sighs> So basically, what he means by retro, he means going back to like um, the original Nintendo 64 all the way to Sega Genesis or no, Game no, Boy. no N64. What's what's the most recent? He you can't can go. go he can't do. He can't. Bleh, he can't stream those. Yeah, the computer's not capable of handling them. Okay, I have it yeah. down. NES, Game Boy, SNES, Genesis, and GBA. I probably yeah, may I have guess, forgotten a thing or two. Let me go check. GBA, NES, Genesis, NES. Angle reached my dude. Cause so, uh, why not yeah, stay I vote awesome. Red Rescue cool. Team. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, I'm at hiccup? exactly 400 bucks now. I, I had a very... I made... I'm very proud of myself, too. I'm, like, patting myself on the back right now. Good job, let's see. I made a very delicious steak dinner. Ooh. Oh, it was bliss. Ooh, filet, yum! And before anybody asks or questions, yes, they were medium rare, baby. <laughs> that is the correct. None of that well, well done shit. Wrapped in bacon. I mean, Ooh. yeah, there shouldn't okay. have to be a question because all steaks should be made medium rare. <laughs> it's the only way to eat steak wrapped in bacon. Oh, oh yeah, absolutely that too. Chris's mother is kind of weird. She won't eat What's the Red Rescue the other team? way except well done. Okay, uh, I'm sorry you have to unplug the life support. <laughs> Dude! <laughs> wow! She's Wait, too far gone. What? What? I don't know. I, I'm not... I, I just realized there. I got over several messages on Skype that I haven't answered, and I'm like, oh, wait a minute. Ooh, I gotta look oh, you too, huh? Me. Oh yeah. Which I, one, I know how though? you feel about that bliss. <laughs> I don't no. know. Fuck elephant. Mother. Fuck. Motherfucking head. <laughs> what? I heard what every third what? word of that. I heard every third word of that, and it was fuck. So. What are y'all giggling about? Is there something going on in the chat? I'm not saying. No, I'm reacting to the fact Ellie is getting all aggressive all of a sudden. Good God. My fucking neighbor's upstairs. Oh. Oh, God. Emphasis on the fucking part, because I'm pretty sure that's what they're doing. <laughs> Better be some damn good fucking from the, from the audio. God no, there was damn. no Final Fantasy VII on Make the Jedi. Make it easy on your Jedi. fucking floorboard. <laughs> About how well-rounded are these fellows? Uh, all right. Um, like catch it up. And then they jump on each other like trampolines. That I would not be surprised if that was what they really do. It's See, that's when that's when you just gotta so get a broom right. and just jab it up into the scene and be like, "Hey, keep it down." Oh, there <laughs> we okay, go. Some, okay, goodness in the TF2 project. So that's There's good. a Scooby Doo game on the uh, Super NES. Oh, huh. what the, I think there was. Oh, that. I'm trying to remember. Oh, <sighs> Brody yeah, Cut yeah. is gonna be fun. Oh, Brody well, Cut I'm is sure gonna it be is. fun. Also, sorry if you hear screaming children on my ends. I hate our neighbors. So, uh, uh, yeah, that's about how I feel right now. Okay, so for some reason, <laughs> I I think I I think I need to fix this. Um, and don't squash your jolly G. I get to spend the whole week with them alone. Oh, God. Uh, he's got... Is there some kids in his neighborhood? Is what he's freaking out about. Oh, my. Squash your golly G, everyone. Every, every neighbor around this apartment is, is awful. That's why I suggest that you invest you in a fire. You have a very big fez. Uh. <laughs> well, gee, kid, you have a very big head. Oh, <laughs> oh you I did not just hey, make kid, fun of get... my head. Hey, my kid, you got that pretty big head. Be a shame if somebody put a fucking hole in it. Calm down, my God. Oh, take it easy. When I take it easy. 
And let me levitate Jasper up. Somebody and give Jasper some. Somebody Whoa. give Jasper a, a, a cake or something. Good God, where's Pinkie Pie when you need her? So she needs to get a cupcake. That's why the donation messages were ginormous. It was set that high. Good Lord. Wait, I just realized. I'm flying. I'm flying. <laughs> I'm flying. And cue the fall. You're not flying. You're falling with style. <laughs> My body is now sad. All right, so that <laughs> no. should hopefully be I fixed. I think that's the key word for saying that it's in pain. I will say this. When Myth uh, donated, uh, you know, the money with the Kaboom, I still think it's hilarious that it was just Kaboom and big text right there. <laughs> no, it like when I love that when it comes to the uh, that the text to speech message, it's just Kaboom. Yeah. Kaboom. <laughs> Expecting an earth shattering kaboom. <laughs> ah, I know where you got that. Earth shattering kabooms make me angry. <laughs> very angry indeed. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Where's the kaboom? There's supposed to be an earth shattering kaboom. Here, I got one for you. Right up your pew! <laughs> I know this is in reference. Your earthly attempts at innuendo make me angry. Oh my god. <laughs> I could always do worse. You want me to do worse? Penis. <laughs> you know what? Give me a minute. And I know you want to if you outright say penis, you get an F minus minus said sexual humor. <laughs> I didn't say anything. Oh, hey, I was so so real sexual so humor. You can see me in the bedroom. <laughs> I can't breathe. Oh, hey, well, you I'll should probably Jasper. try to figure that out. Thumbs, you can post the link. Somebody wants to say hi to you. <laughs> Hello, person who wants to say hi. I swear for my soul and everything <laughs> Um, Jasper is now clinging on to the chair. Wrong! I'm clinging on top of the refrigerator! Get your glasses, woman! <laughs> Sorry! Yeah, you big dumb dummy idiot. Watch it! Why? Where is it going? It's gotta go to places you don't want it to be. <laughs> Jokes on you, it's probably already been there. A much more pleasurable experience. Ah! I'm never coming down here for the rest of my existence! Tweak! Chill! <laughs> down, boy! Down! <laughs> what are you cool doing? Cool it, Why don't you find some moldy toast to chew on? Somebody give me a cup of tea! Twink! 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 Here's the cupcake! Twink! Twink! Twink, buddy! Twink, buddy, buddy. Uncle Jasper's learned his lesson. I assure you, he has. I did. I mean, yes, I did. I definitely did. I learned the lesson. Hey, you know what? You know what? I got something in response. <laughs> oh no! Neat. Golden! What was that? <laughs> Damn it, that was motherfucking job. Sinistar. That was one of the earlier arcade games that gave people quite a scare tactic. Oh no, oh, yeah. I'm shaking my little golden hoofies. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh, what Lauren is for. By oh, the my. way, um, sorry if I... <laughs> by the way, by the way, sorry if I'm sounding a little egotistic here. Have any of you seen my recent video? Yes, I have, Not actually. Yet. I did. I, I commented on it. Yes, Golden. Apparently, you seem a little jealous over a particular pony. Who Fuck has you. Who just a neighbor, right? <laughs> All the shade. Oh, my God. I'm not the... I'm, I'm glad I... I 
Rocket, will you stop the Michael Bay sound effects? Please. Wig! Get down! That if was we just want to make really one. weird noises, I'm pretty sure I can... Oh, well, still. If we just want to throw weird noises at each other, I'm pretty sure I can top anything that a uh, rainbow pack... <laughs> Brace yourselves. You don't want to underestimate solar. What? for it okay i just oh, wait, realized that solar's been muted for me the whole time and i forgot oh yeah when he was here he muted himself for me and i'm like oh now i can oh, yeah. hear solar i'm waiting for it i'm just making it awkward now <laughs> oh Was gonna happen you're inviting him to do it so he's not gonna do it until he's not, not paying attention. yeah no i have to wait until everybody forgets <sighs> about it and then do it uh, sorry guys I'm... sorry guys i'm sorry i didn't really <laughs> I, I don't understand why is he in the call and muted i don't get it and then i realized oh wait a minute Twist it's of because fate. I was invading your living space. Hey guys, hang on a long second long twist of fate if michael bay's gonna try to make an asmr channel good luck oh mm -hmm. fuck. right for crying out loud. It's like, hey. I I'm heard not, that. No, no, it's like, not every, I want, I want some absolute silence to be like, hey, I'm Michael Bay. I got something cool to show you to help you relax. Kaboom! And, <laughs> and what the hey was that? It sounded like a jet flying over. What was that? I heard something, I heard a weird Whoa. noise right after Solar burped. Oh, something I forgot to, um, I keep, uh, forgetting is that somebody did a, um, um, a, ha a ROM hack of Mario All-Stars and replaced all the sprites with ponies. <laughs> that would be hilarious to stream at one point. That would be Meanwhile, fun. Meanwhile, I am harassing, uh, Miss Pony on her DeviantArt. Excuse me. <laughs> Neat. God damn it! Within! 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 Where's my within? My god! All right, let's take a look at this picture. It. What the fuck? <laughs> if you hear me growling, it's because the flapper and kids next door slam the door. And not the good fix. kids next door. Um, right? <laughs> well, that's a picture. <laughs> <laughs> okay, somebody needs to draw a Jasper with a with almost as a foam mouth over around some fillies. We need one. We need one of those. Wait, what am I doing? You're foam. You're literally growling. So it's I'm envisioning you foaming at the mouth over about over in pure rage around some kids. Well, it's just that to quote Mark Chain from Fairly Odd Parents, the laughter of children. I cannot take the laughter of children. <laughs> oh gosh. Great children. Oh lordy. God damn it. Oh well. No. Jesus Christ. Children! <laughs> I will however do that occasionally. Children! But Uncle Jasper! Uncle <laughs> Jasper new thing! But Uncle! Uncle Jasper mine! <laughs> but... We only... Uncle Jasper yet! <laughs> <What>? <laughs> What? <laughs> what? What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know. It's Jasper. He's just as bad as Pinky. We it's why they're really gang for years. Yep, it's in the family blood. In the, top Pinky, of the family blood. It family. It blood. Yes. Oh, thank you, Blissy. I love that You're movie. <laughs> I love that movie! What movie? Yeah, that's right, man! His family! He blood! <laughs> he, it's from Oliver and Company! Oh, Tito the Chihuahua! Okay. Ne okay, whenever it comes to Tito, half the time I sometimes can't understand his pronunciations. <laughs> hey, Frankie, man, what you watching, man? I mean, does it got to go? I mean, what happened? Shut up, you little rodent! Hey, man, this uh stuff is boring, man! <laughs> Come on, let's put the box in, man. I want to see some action. <laughs> My name is Francis. Not Frank. Not Frankie. Not Frankie. Francis. 
No, no. kitty, man. So it's what did you bring in today, Francis? It's none of your <laughs> business, you little pipsqueak. <laughs> we can you know, make quote. I don't care what anybody thinks. Oliver and Company is one of the funnest Disney movies ever made. I agree. It was I like, uh, obviously, the, like, the way people criticize it, it's so gimmicky because you have so many celebrities from the 80s, like Billy Joel and what have you. But hey, newsflash on you fuckwads who want to complain about that. It's fucking Disney. Yeah, In every the... Disney movie is going to have a big name celebrity. <clears throat> Lion and King has a shit bed. ton. Matthew Broderick, Nathan Lane, Jeremy Irons. Yep. Oh, and let's not forget, uh, like, some more recent ones, like Tangled. Because Shh. the the one who voices Rapunzel, she's a big celebrity, too. And you're gonna call <laughs> Oliver and Company gig gimmicky when they had a guy killed by a train. Yeah, I know. That oh, scene was amazing. Dunk. That entire train that... sequence. Holy shit. I have to agree. That was like one of the most surreal deaths. That's like, oh god, it's that it was in a Disney that's... film. Like, okay, there have been like other brutal Disney films, but something like that would be in like Beverly Hills Cop or some shit. Right? Time between that and Clayton's death and Tarzan. Oh yeah, I remember yeah, that. That one, was, that one was my most memorable Disney death. Yeah, because oh, I remember I seeing that on the that. Disney Channel. I'm like, holy shit! I remember watching that in theaters, and that disturbed <clears throat> me. So so much in the theater. I'm like, uh, he got hanged. He got hanged. No, he didn't oh just God. get hanged. He didn't just get hanged. He probably had his neck broken on top of that. What do you oh, think? Yeah. What do you think hanging? Yeah, what contrary to popular belief, getting hanged does not a is not meant to kill you by strangling you. It breaks your fucking neck. If it if your neck doesn't get broken first, the choking will. <laughs> What if you're like light as a feather and don't got no neck? <laughs> then uh, your job is a hunt. Or you get the javelin, I don't know. <laughs> I remember that was. All I heard about you cut out from me, all I heard was got no. <laughs> oh God. But I have to definitely agree about Oliver, Oliver and Company when it came to that death scene of like good lord and the scary thing is that could happen in real life yeah yeah if you're That's stupid weird. enough to go on the train tracks oh yes well if i drive a car onto the train tracks yeah into a the goddamn that maybe subway train that goes one well. way yeah right i mean sykes uh. he wanted to go out to vegas and he was so goddamn dedicated that he fucked up his tires no joke! I'm like, good <laughs> god, that's terrifying. Well, to be fair, one of the most- one of the most longest-lasting thing is mad stupidity. <laughs> In mad stupidity. You know, I- I think a better way to say this, Jasper. Mad stupidity is, like, the longest killer. Indeed no joke. it is. Because sometimes, okay. uh, like, stu like, mad stupidity can come in so many different shapes and sizes. For instance, uh, my brother showed me a clip from uh, Game of Thrones where one guy was seeking vengeance over his own brother, and he was um, he was on a battlefield with some mm -hmm. big dude where his blades had poison. Oh yeah. And he just like he like he defeats him supposedly, and it's like you killed my brother, you raped him, and you did this, and all of a sudden the big guy just gets back at him and stabs him back <laughs> because oh, he let his own oh. pride and his own. Um, his own pride and I can't even just find the words here. His own personal victory uh, get the best of him too much to the point where the guy who was down, they both died together. There's a term for that. I think it's uh, letting your guard down. Yes, it is. Yeah. And that I was the name... result of mad stupidity. I can think of another, a few other ones that are just like, Ursula is a good example of that. Oh, yes. So much for true love. All of a sudden, pfft, you got punctured in the chest by a fucking, by a fucking mask. I mean, how do you fucking miss a boat stabbing exactly. you in the chest? Stab, not stab, mention, stab. Not to mention along with that. It's she not got like freaking... he could have fucking snuck up on her. It's a fucking boat. It's a it's goddamn a ship. ship. <laughs> <laughs> Not to mention, along with that, which shipping killed, shipping you have the whole fucking ocean. 
to move around and you get impaled by a fucking boat. <laughs> Okay. I was gonna add along with that. Occupied with turning Ariel into chum. Yeah. Along with that, along with that, after she got stabbed right through with the boat, she also got struck in the lightning from behind. Yikes. So double. That's like overkill to me. Like that, 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 that's just that's oh, not your day. It's just calamari. not your day. Anybody up for some calamari? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need some calamari. The fuck. Yeah. Uh, wow, you're fuck. You're a disgrace to this planet. You know, Get the you, fuck know you know, you know what I'm. I don't like squid and octopus. Okay. You're you know, a you know. Speaking disgrace. of which, you know what I'm now in the mood for because of this Calamari. sushi. Ooh. What? Sushi. Sushi. Yay. I always want. Fuck yeah, I love sushi. I remember when Me we too. were there for the wedding. We went to by that fucking sushi place. Ooh. Ooh. She was good. Well, am I okay? That's a, holy shit. Hello, my name is Jay, and I don't like sushi. I jumped right Aww. into that. It's I okay. Right You're not alone, Joey. We still love you. Yes. I still love you. Da -da -da. Don't feel bad, Jasper. My mom doesn't like sushi because she doesn't like fish. I'm sorry, like you need it. to pull the Once life support. What the fuck is wrong what with you? What the fuck are those people doing? Fucking <laughs> people. What, what, what are you getting so pissy about? What's going on? What time okay. is it over there for you, Ellie? It is a quarter after. A quarter, a quarter after, after what? what? Quarter after ten. Okay, uh, then if they they could technically be breaking the law, then. Yeah, disturbing the peace. Just just do the same shit they do and be like, um, y'all need to keep it the fuck down. <laughs> or you can call the police for a noise disturbance. Simple as that. Let's see, because the I think the law is for. Most states. God damn it, Jedi! You know, the last bitch. time I do you guys remember the last time I had involved when it came to noise? Solar. Oh yeah, that's because you were screaming because you couldn't handle a video game. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe there's reason luck to involve. Okay. Well, you're um, not screaming bloody murder this time, so I feel like you know it'll probably yeah. sway more in your favor this time. Also, uh, okay, another example of what sheer stupidity to a villain does. Here's another big example. Gaston. Gaston. The what, end. What, what was the stupid thing he did? Uh, be alive. Think, think about how he died. <laughs> he tried uh, to stab Beast. Oh, yeah, he stabbed Beast in yeah, the back and then he fell to his yeah, doom. You know, yeah, let me take stupid. this toothpick and try and stab this muscle-bound beast in the- Yeah, that's gonna fucking work. Yeah. After he was given the first, what? The guy who spared his life? That's a smart boy. He just smart. He gets on top of reaching awards. On yeah, top uh, of I have a castle, no less. I have to give him credit, though. Um, uh, he somehow managed to climb up from that area he was originally down on, pretty much following Beast the same route. Managed to get on top of him, stab him in the back, and still hang on. That is impressive, but it was pretty freaking stupid. Was, yeah. You don't have to give Beast. You don't have to give give the fucker credit for jack shit. <laughs> he literally, he literally had death in his eyes. Literally, yeah, yeah there is not one frame where those skulls did. in his eyes. Yeah, yeah I remembered. I it, remembered that. Yeah, because it's him knowing you're fucked. <laughs> yep. That's what pretty much ways where stupid ways villains died. Well, I, I kind of feel like Scar was stupid. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. okay, to explain- to sell uh, the hyenas out. Yeah. Yeah, no, you know why? Because he was a fucking coward, and he was a fucking coward because he did not have the right, uh, responsibility being king, so... It makes sense. He yeah. tried to sell the hyenas out, and of course, he obviously did not take that kindly. Friends? I thought he said we were the enemy. Yeah, yeah. that's what I heard. Ed. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. He gets eaten alive. The end. Yep. <laughs> Circle of life, folks. That's <laughs> what you that that phenomenon. Yeah, done, goof. Yeah, I'm actually right. I'll be researching a lot of Disney over the weekends for my new Watch Mojo list. And you, you still gotta give Scar credit because he did get shit done. Like he did what? manage to do one thing. He killed he, Mufasa. He did the thing that he set out to do as a villain, which was kill yeah, Mufasa that's not and take the throne. 
On top of, you know, duping Simba into believing that he was responsible for the entire... He, he got... He got shit done. Oh, I know. I know another one. Here's another one. Jafar! Well, oh, on, let's yes. Think about, let's think about that for a second. Yeah. Let's think about that. The genie has he, more power than you he... ever have. What? He gave you your power. He could take it away. You're he right. Did I, I wouldn't say that was stupid. He clearly just did not know the rules and laws of being a genie he he didn't think it fit through very well However, no, the thing was, was aladdin just played on his, aladdin just played on his lust for power that wasn't something that that was necessarily present that was his character flaw that got taken it you yeah, know what? okay i will yes. give you that like obviously yeah he was playing uh playing off of his lust but also and i was even thinking did maleficent screw up no she did not technically she did not she went full-blown dragon berserker she just not oh, she no. just did not determine or predict that the fairies were powerful enough to charm a sword that would kill her <laughs> Oh See, yeah, that's that, the thing. That's not... the thing that a lot of people don't seem to realize. You don't fuck with fairies. <laughs> no, you. Uh, <laughs> fairies will fuck you up really bad. <laughs> Thank you. He saw you. you. Jafar still made it work in the sequel, Return of Jafar, where he took his condition and set up and planned an actually elaborate revenge. Okay, what about Hades? Hades was just a frustrated dip, uh, dipshit. That's all I can say about yes, him. Was. Yeah, he wasn't an idiot. He was just—he was an idiot, but he wasn't. As but everybody in that movie was kind of. No, 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 no. He was an idiot. And what's that? No, I said he was an idiot. He made the stupid mistake of grab, grabbing makes soulless body, or soul, soul, I should say, grabbing her soul and making her act like a puppet. Hercules, Meg, Meg, talk to her. A uh, loose schmooze. Uh, yeah, yeah, you asked for it, dude. Well, okay, also, here's another one that is a pretty good one. Lady Tremaine. Lady Tremaine, I like, I... Her, in her teeth over and repeatedly. Lady Tremaine? <laughs> okay, uh, the, uh, the, the, the... Yeah, the... the Evil stepmother. Oh, God, it's been so long since I've seen that movie. <laughs> okay, let me... Her in her teeth. <laughs> okay, to explain what she did was considered stupid. She tried to lock up Cinderella underestimating her little animal friends of course but of course naturally she wouldn't even realize that she had animals. i don't even yeah, think she, she didn't realized know. the animals were around yeah, yeah also that's the thing. to go along with that she pretty much didn't think that um the grand duke was gonna have was gonna try out have cinderella try out the shoe she obviously was trying to convince him that she was not worth it but of course he still has to follow his orders as being every maiden so, of course, she also tried to destroy the glass slipper. However, she it was obvious that she was her. She knew it was Cinderella's shoe, but she didn't think on the fact that she had the other half. So, yeah, she screwed herself over by not by pretty much not thinking all the way tr through herself. You know, let's see. What other villain was really stupid? That yeah, I'm trying to think, of, to think um, of some more. Uh, hold on, let me get a list of The poacher more. from Rescuers Down Under. Oh! Oh! Yes. He led himself to a stupid. fucking but waterfall But I also think down. he was designed to be stupid, so I don't know how much... I haven't actually seen Down Under yet. Oh, uh, you are missing you out, dude. It is worth it. Uh, it's one of my favorite sequels. Yeah. Mine too. Okay, um... I also haven't seen Great Mouse Detective, and I'm regretting that there I said it. Okay. Oh. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's never too late to see them. So every time that I hear that somebody's yeah, seen a certain movie, <laughs> if if I if I may, I'm pretty Bad. sure you can find them on YouTube for like three dollars. Yeah, no, <laughs> like if, if I may, if there's a movie that a lot of people have seen but one person hasn't, don't flip. They still have the opportunity to see it. Yes, exactly. Make him stop. Make him stop what? <gasps> Make him stop saying if I may. Yeah, because I'm trying. <laughs> God dang it! I'm sorry, Ellie. I can't. I'm sorry. But this this is flying over her. my head. What what was the implication? <laughs> it, 
it, it's a brony D D shtick we have. Oh. You for me. Well, is anyway. that because you guys are all talking over each other multiple times? No, it's no. it's Jay. It's it's nothing else entirely. Um, Luna Corva has a verbal tick. Where... He, he has this verbal tick or um, tradition where he says, "If I may," and it's been driving us ladies flipping bonkers. <laughs> So it, he started doing it on purpose. Before he wasn't. Now he, Yeah, now he's just doing it on purpose. Oh. <laughs> well, that's what makes it funny. Well, Shut bless. Up. No. <laughs> Go to dance. <laughs> if I may. Go to hell. If I may. <laughs> Go to hell. <laughs> you may go to hell. You know you can also go to? Go to dance. Dance. <laughs> Okay, I had a oh, I had a villain. A I had a villain. What was the villain? Let me think. What name what was the Dizzy movie? I'm trying to think. What was the Giznet oh, movie? Madam Mad someone brought up the rescuers down under. Well what about Madam Medusa? Madam Medusa oh. was just okay, yeah. Um she was just a moron the whole time. Indeed. Well, okay, I, I know this money. is a character. I want money. I know this is a character flaw, but like, okay, the first dumb thing she did was back out of the deal she had with, uh, what's his name? Uh, Sweeps? S uh, Snoops. Snoops? Yeah. So she backed out of the deal with Snoops. That was her first dumb mistake. Um, and then the second mistake is, granted, the mice did this to her, but come on, how do you trip over a line like that? That's so freaking stupid. How do you um, trip over a tripwire? Well, as it turns out, a tripwire is designed specifically to trip people and not really be noticed. So, nah, okay, fair enough. But okay, her her. Like, there's a reason that a tripwire is still a very popular booby trap to have in pretty much any si okay. any type of fantasy setting. Okay, I'll let it slide. Okay, here comes the other stupid thing she did. Uh, abused her out uh, her abused her crocodiles Neo and Brutus. Okay, here's the thing that if, if you abuse animals, you deserve whatever the animals do you in return. Okay, yeah. to go along with that, with that fact, the fact she had two crocodiles as pets. That What's wrong is with a... having two crocodiles as pets? Once I could have the potential to eat you alive. I mean, maybe if you didn't abuse them. Even if you didn't, they would not hesitate to kill you. Mm, debatable. <laughs> she, listen to the kid. She knows what's up. <laughs> she, she, she's asking the important question. Yes. Asking okay. the real questions here. It's a. It's relating to a Disney villain, baby. Oh. <laughs> you should see her face. She's like, oh. <laughs> Does she, Nicole? Do you not like Disney villains? Do they make you mad? Hey. That's the point. Said, yeah, that's the like idea. Villain? That's the idea. Oh, I am proud of this girl. What is she like? What? Which one's your favorite Disney movie so far, baby? Uh, Incredibles. The Incredibles? Yeah. She likes The Incredibles. She I didn't know she was Up top. Up top. The Incredibles was amazing. Mm hmm. I did like The Incredibles. For a little bit. No, Movie technically, that's more of a uh, Pixar Disney thing. Well, that's but a thing. Whatever, we count. We count Toy Story. The yeah, no, I like nowadays. I'd every... say if it has Disney in the title, so Disney. Yeah, Pixar, pretty much any movie now. from Disney is just considered a Disney movie at this point. Because hey, like half the what time, I'm so used to like whenever it comes to Disney movies, I mostly associate like with just the animated stuff. films. Okay. Another but... one she also likes is Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, my God. Because... <laughs> we just <laughs> we just recently watched the animation of it at my sister's library because they were doing the thing for spring break with it. They were so Beauty and Beast was on when we came over, and she got to watch it finally. <laughs> I have. Uh, excuse me. Neat. My my sister loves that movie too. It's like one of her personal favorites. What Incredibles? No, Beauty and the Beast. The cartoon. It's it's good. I'm still having a hard time pinpointing what's my favorite, and I can't help but think. Whoa, oh, damn it! I got a couple already that were like my most favorites, especially growing up. 
The first one was the Sword in the Stone. Yeah. I'm a sucker Ooh. for King Arthur stories. Are we talking about anime? Sorry, I said boy for a bit. Are we talking anime or Disney or just Disney overall? Pretty much Disney, Disney overall. Yeah. In that case, the... my, my top three favorites are Mary Poppins, Aladdin, and Emperor's New Groove. Yeah! Oh, oh, my choices. Okay, my mom will be a, such a big bud with you because she loves Mary Poppins as well. It's like her most favorite movie. Has she seen Mary Poppins Returns? Ooh, I don't question. think so, but she did say she did saw the movie, the one previous to it. Um, that was like the story about how Disney got the try to get the way to make Mary Poppins the actual Disney movie. When the, it was telling like a story behind it. Oh, you mean she Saving Mr. Banks? That. Yes, Saving Mr. Banks. She got to watch that. that. She cried. I'm a little mixed about it, and well, you know me. Whenever it comes to movies based on historical uh, facts, the artistic liberties can really get under my skin. But um, another uh, Disney movie aside from The Sword in the Stone that I loved as a kid, no matter what, is The Jungle Book. Ooh, for the Hello. bare necessities, the simple bare necessities. Forget about oh, yeah. it. I was never that crazy about the Jungle Book. Favorite. I respected it, and you know, it was uh, the one. Um, I think it was the last Disney movie that Disney was involved in before he died, or something. Yeah, it was. It was the final Disney movie before the final movie he helped partake making before he passed away. He couldn't. He didn't get a chance to see the full final cut of the actual movie though, because that's when he passed away before it got finished. Yeah. But he. It, that was like the last one he did. Hmm. I remember because oh, I, no. I actually oh. um when I uh when I got it the special edition one like the one of the anniversary ones for it mm -hmm. they had like a like how they how the behind the scenes kind of a uh, a special edition with the DVD so I got to read that part got to watch that part and they said that this was the last one that he did I was like oh so this is the move okay well now I know where he when he died oh, that's so sad I feel sad now thanks thanks a lot company <laughs> pretty much is what I had to say but, um an there was one more that was like uh, more the one of the live action ones um um. Uh, oh yeah, now I remember. It was be uh, bed knobs and broomsticks. I still have yet <gasps> to see that movie. Charlie. You never, you never seen that one? I no, I haven't. I didn't have uh, the the VHS for that. Um, funny oh. enough, uh, Science Steel Rail, who was one of my uh, biggest patrons, uh, plainly obvious there. Um, yes. He was asking because uh, what I used to do was I used to have. A patron perk where I would uh, buy a request, I would review uh, certain movies that they would want me to review. But I also realized that when trying to get the source, it's very challenging. It's true. So I decided, you know what, um, to try to keep up with that but on a monthly basis, that would be too much of a headache. So um, I decided to close it down. And he said, if I had the chance, I would have loved for you to review Ben Ops and Broomsticks. It is actually a pretty good movie. The oh, I'm cast sure it they is. Used, one of them, some of the cast they did, okay, I forgot the name of the actor, but it was the guy who played as Mr. Banks from Mary Poppins. I forgot the name of the actor. But also another one was Angela Lansbury. She oh, got yes. to play as a witch character. <laughs> and like, Before yes, she became she Mrs. Potts. Exactly. There's nowhere to go but the... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, like... Another cool thing about Mary Poppins Returns is that uh, Mary Poppins was played by Emily Blunt, who uh, who was Tempest Shadow. Was, was Tempest Shadow? Yeah, exactly. And, oh, that's fun. Yeah, and we got the uh, we got to have a uh, Dick Van Dyke uh, re like not reprise his role, but make his way into the movie as one of the uh, the banks. Oh, not one of the banks, but the the bank holders. Oh. He was the young Mr. Dawes from the original movie. Yes. The like dude's, the what, 93, 94? Yeah, I think I so. He did the tap dancing thing. I know, in oh, his yeah. 90s, Bill, no less. No joke. That guy's got spunk for his age. That is I amazing. I think that he was quoted one time as saying the way to stay active, to be active as an, as an old man is to stay active. In 
You cut you off the ever stop to dance? Ah. That's that was that's amazing. I re I loved him at, when he played as Bert. He was fun to watch. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he was. is my all-time favorite song from the movie. What's Which uh... one? Step in time. Step in time. Step in Step time. In time. Oh, mate. <laughs> the thing I love the most, and I think every, the, the thing I love the most about Mary Poppins, that I think everybody can agree with this, is the bull scene. <laughs> Him the bull the scene? That was magical. Uh, it's when they were in that bowl, and you have those uh, 2D live, uh, 2D animated characters. Oh yeah, no, absolutely. The bull scene. The bowl. Are you talking about the? Um, are you talking about the? The China vase, whatever the fuck it was. Yeah, that scene. Oh. Yeah. How do you think... not remember that? It's like a really huge it scene. It has a scene where Lin-Manuel Miranda was performing a song that included a little bit of rap to a degree by going yeah. over but yeah, by going over one of those stories. I think that was in one of the Wait, What movie scenes. are we talking about? Mary Poppins Returns. The first one Oh, the first it's the second one. one. Okay. And the, the second, second one, one, there was a okay, broken I'm bolt that the kids the were invited one. into. I've oh. not seen the second one, so... Uh, uh, girl, you need to fix that. It's out yeah. on video. It is one of on my, video. Uh, okay, okay, one of my favorite... So screwed up. <laughs> one of my uh, favorite songs from Mary Poppins that I I still love listening to was Chim Chimmery. Chim Chimmery, Chim 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 as lucky can be. Chim, I cannot chim, remember chim, the lines to <laughs> this song, but I oh, like to oh, hum oh, it oh, all oh, day long. Oh, oh blow me a kiss. Yes. And that's and lucky, that's lucky too. <laughs> I, one song that always stuck in my head, and I admit, got me got me to clean. It was that song she made for the Jobs game and Swiss. Without Oh, a spoonful of sugar! A spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down. Medicine go down. Medicine go down. Fun fact! A you know Robin mending his nest with very little time to rest <laughs> while gathering fun. his branch of twine and twig. I cannot remember the last time I saw you. I'm going to sing along with the toots. He knows this is always been a joke. Freaking Ellie over there is like, kill me. And a spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down. The medicine go down. Medicine go down. First, y'all are telling me. He loves the Robin. I love the Robin. I'm sorry. Y'all are tone deaf. I am not. Stop. What <laughs> the fuck not. did you link me, Thumbs? Okay, fun fact about that bird, the part that part with the bird, yeah. that was her whistling as well. They recorded her whistling when that happened. That's cute. <laughs> and that just makes me sad because of the whole surgery thing. Mm -hmm. Aww. Let's see. I'm trying to remember, um... Also, I have one. bubble wrap. Yeah, what? I have bubble wrap, and I'm trying oh. to pop it! <laughs> oh, you too? Hang on. Okay, there's one movie I really like for the one song it had, and it was, uh, yeah, The Great Mouse Detective Easy. Oh, yes. Oratigan! Oratigan! The Great Mastermind! Radigan! I just rat. <laughs> what? <laughs> what was that? What did you call me? Oh, he, he didn't, didn't mean, mean it, Professor. You when it when, was just a tip of the tongue. when the other right, henchmen are trying rat. to back up this guy, you know that Radican is not to be fucked with. That is I am not a rat. Of course you're not. You're a mouse. Yeah, that's right. Right, a mouse. Yeah, a, a, a big mouse. Silence. <laughs> oh, my dear Bartholomew, I am afraid you've gone and upset me. You know what happens when someone upsets me. That oh. means you die. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Imagine lightning blizzards at Ratican now. <laughs> what was that? 
What did you call me? I am not short. <laughs> I thought it was cute. <laughs> I am not cute. <laughs> oh God! Lightning was the cutest pony. Don't die. Ever. What? <laughs> I was thinking more like Rainbow Marshmallow. <coughs> Because you hate being called a marshmallow. Oh, the little rainbow <laughs> marshmallow. Yeah. Yes, bubble wrap too hard. <laughs> what do you mean it's too hard? It's easy. Uh, please struggle. Please push. Oh my god, there actually is a Scooby-Doo game on the SNES. Kill me. And it's made <laughs> by Sunsoft, it so it may be good. Let's... At least it's not LJN. Yeah, it's made by... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's not made by uh, Let's Just Not. Heaven forbid it not. Oh. Please. I mean, is there any other L? I mean, I know I know there's a shit ton of LJN games, but is there like any other LJN game that is just absolutely torturous that anybody would name off? Here's a better question: Is there any LJN game that's actually good? Yeah, <laughs> Spider-Man: Maximum well Carnage. Excuse me. Yes, marshmallows in my name. Honestly, the fire tail part of it, I like. <laughs> Yeah, I'm wondering how I might See, let the name you... slip out outside of the Dr. Wolf office episode. I'm trying to... See, whenever um... they say Fire Tail, I'm just reminded of that one attack from Power Rangers Mystic Force. <laughs> Are you okay, Jasper? I think, he, I think he finally popped one. <laughs> it sounded oh, like he finally popped one. Oh, I popped one right next to my ear. Ah! Right Why'd you put it next to your ear? What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> you are acting like I did this voluntarily! Like I just got here and a doo! I have a bubble wrap bu 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 right next to my ear listening hole! <laughs> well, that's what it sounds like, all things considered. Like, how do you fucking pop it next to your ear accidentally? Boom! Like that. <laughs> <laughs> is Nicole being She's, silly? He said that she drew a little bunny rabbit. Aww. Bunny rabbit family. Family. Okay, my bad. A bunny rabbit family. In house, he's ah, I see. <laughs> God dang, Jasper! If you ever met my kid, you probably melt. <laughs> Because she's a sweetheart. She's made Blissey melt. Well, she's a marshmallow, so. <laughs> <laughs> now so, that I think about it, marshmallow and fire tail in the same sentence. Yeah, how do you not melt constantly? That's that's been puzzling me for a bit. <laughs> well, 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 she's he's not wrong, Blissey. He's not wrong with the name. <laughs> how are you not constantly in a state of agony? Name. It's not my physical body type. But I mean, they got the marshmallow part in there, right? Oh my god, I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> you can try, but you have to reach that high first. I can, you dumbass. I know <laughs> you've been here. I can reach it. Actually, I'm kind of pissed off that you left too soon. You didn't get me a back pop. Oh. <laughs> well, you should have asked before I left. I didn't. I, I was sad you were leaving. <laughs> I was distracted by the fact that you were leaving. Okay. <laughs> the, but after seeing that... Yeah, episode... you hear that, everybody else in the comments? Yeah, I got to pop Bliss's back. Later. <laughs> Solar? <laughs> I'm just gonna back away. <laughs> Solar? Shut up! It's natural or Lou. Just picks me up and let's grab... Good God. <laughs> And it feels amazing afterwards. Oh, I'm I know. sure it does. I've had it done to me, so. I might need a little bit of that myself. Because let me tell you, 
I'm getting too old for this. For kid this business. Bullshit. For the kid business. She's already wearing me down. And she's not even to that right age of starting school. <sighs> but yeah. The, but to get back to that episode with Alice, it got me to think about like, oh, do you think I should give my... I do... Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. It's like a... Okay. Repeat that again. I'm sorry. I'm actually talking to the pupper right now. <laughs> um, with After that episode that you did with Dr. Wolf, it got me to think, wait, wait I should do the same for my for her little OC. So I, oh, I came up with... Name. Yeah, give her a full along with the middle name. Aw. Because, because of the fact she's a halfling of a Karen and a changeling, I thought, mm -hmm. okay, maybe I should add a little bit of something that's like a changeling like name to uh -huh. to like give her character more fitting term. So I came up with Faithful Flutterby Sunshine. Oh Aww. Jesus. Let me move that down. <laughs> I wanted something that would roll off the tongue, but also have a reason why Bliss has never said her For her. <laughs> now the honor part comes from the fact that Firetail is a combo of her papa and her dad. And yeah. yeah. Oh god. Really? What? My Emily? Jesus Christ. Some looks like the game oh. looks like the game works, but unfortunately the call is not doing well in favor. <laughs> Come on! Whoa, oh Jesus! Well, back to where I was. Dad, yeah. so. Easy. No! Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. It says I beat it. We're touching it again. I have not touched <sighs> this game. Up this way, okay. I'm giving it a little test like run, and unfortunately, the call itself is not sitting well. Okay, let me see if I can try to get up on this ledge. Oh no! Oh, oh! oh. Lost a lot of progress. That's a deep frustration, a real punch in the gut. Yeah, fuck this game. You. Why don't no. you fuse with somebody that's tall so then you can become average sized at least? Because that would make me OP and it doesn't work that way. Yeah, that didn't stop you yeah. with Aeon, so I don't want to hear it. Well, because ah! was... Okay, first off, he's the one who conducted the fusion first, and secondly, the fusion is OP. I can only do it with people I have a personal or special connection with, so F off. 
Does that mean we can never kiss? I said we have to have a special connection. What's our connection? We both study or under A. We both breathe air. How about that? You're, yeah. You're in a princess. Checkmate. I'm I'm a I don't know what I am. Yeah, what are you? Fusion partner. I, I, I'm I'm very careful about throwing the fusion around now because I've had fans, like the really overexerted fans, just randomly fuse me with their OCs and I've seen some pretty fusion. scary God shit, guys. <laughs> oh, I don't doubt it. <gasps> oh my god, I actually had an idea at some point. What? Mm. Okay, so in one of these future post shows, um, anybody that's left <laughs> in the call, quit blash. Oh! Yes. I will do I'm the quick flash. I played it before, so I know how, I know how the game works. It's hilarious as shit. It is. It's fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I see what Luigi Man said. Lucy plus oh. Jesse Fusion. Wouldn't it just be a, a fusion much... of? Wouldn't that just be the same person? I was gonna say, no. wouldn't it be a much much bigger bliss? No. <laughs> First off, oh, we wouldn't be the same. I guess my character's a Kieran. <laughs> How does that even well, then, work? well, then a really, really big Kieran uh, Bliss. A Kieran corn. Kieran what? A Kieran corn. An <laughs> Alec Kieran. Kieran. Alec Kieran. <laughs> Again, guys, guys, don't abuse the fusion, man. Don't abuse the fuse. Don't abuse the fuse. Hey. I like that. Okay. I'm keeping that. I'm gonna yes. I'm gonna say that while slowly sliding a pair of sunglasses over my face. <laughs> hey, kiddos, don't abuse the fuse. I mean, admittedly, I can visualize characters of bliss fusing with their friends because, admittedly, and no, I'm not trying to brag or toot my own horn. Bliss is probably the easiest thing to fuse with because she is a pure white well not pure white but she's a white alicorn so really when it comes to <laughs> it's easier to fuse if you're white it is <laughs> you heard it here first folks. white All right, i quit i quit <laughs> i quit i mean i get you know what she's saying uh, color just wise that, just for all that i ain't never fusing with anybody outside of aeon yeah y'all just suck that ship <laughs> good job, good job. Good hey, I wasn't the one who said it, was I? Literally nothing. Now you were laughing with it, though. Oh, it's okay. God. I'll find my own fusion partner. Uh, I'm yeah, giving you your own fusion, boy. <laughs> yeah, Morpheus, go Golden Fox. Morpheus, I mean, why shut not? Up. Morpheus, just for Cespio fuse. They blow up the internet. <laughs> Morpheus, shut up. Bear, a, a fusion between. Bliss would probably be disaster because we both already have horrible tempers and we're both already horrendous powerful. Yeah. Oh, well. Uh, um. Literally, the only reason I was that Eliora was unable to restrain um Thunder Blight was because of the power. Let's see. I, I, I admit I am thinking what kind of character would the Ellie Bliss Fusion be, and what would we call her? Hmm. Because again, like Euphoria is basically her own character now—a healthy combination, a, a healthy personality of Aeon and Bliss. But she takes those personalities and makes them her own, so she becomes her own individual. So, so we would have, have to know who our character, who the character, would be before we. Right. We basically see Euphoria took months of talking and thinking and figuring out before she officially came to life. Months of talking and metaphors and philosophy. I admit, and I suck at philosophy, so that's telling you something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and, and just trying to figure out. No! God damn! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Alrighty then. I um. Oh, so, God. me and Eliora would have to pick each other's brain and figure out what kind of people we are. Like, literally, Ellie and me, we, we would have to sit down for a few weeks, yeah. maybe even a month, and pick each other's brains. I mean, I'm okay <laughs> with that. We already know each other well. I'd say we do, yeah. 
And we'd have to basically pinpoint our strongest personality traits and then slap those into the character. And then we would have to come up with a name. Okay, here's a pop quiz for people. What's the what's my strongest personality trait? Gee, I couldn't sass. tell. Your sass. Gee, that was hard. Your <laughs> <laughs> ability to make me deflect my own words of myself. <laughs> that falls so, right under the sass. Child. So this character would be a a very charismatic, sassy character who is not afraid to backhand you. Yeah. Okay. So uh... nice fucking model. <laughs> <laughs> you know okay. A fusion between Blissy and Ellie would be Bismuth. 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 I mean, Maybe. Uh, actually, when Bismuth first came to me, I actually had a number of people message me and ask if I had done some voice work for Cartoon Network. Wow. Just I'm wow. not kidding you. That's I mean, so. People that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. I don't know if Bismuth would fully fit the personalities of both me and Ellie though, because again, Ellie Ellie's personality is gonna have to balance out a hyper anxiety filled Alicorn who has a lot of self doubt and a chip on her shoulder, mixed with her sass and her chip on her shoulder. So... The one thing we both have that would be in a humongous extension is our creative spirits. So, am I please? Uh, no. maybe, but no. they wouldn't. A lot more anger. Thing is, they wouldn't really be named off of an actual gem. I was, would ha I was more like reflecting the personality. <clears throat> oh, okay. Let's see. Um, I'm trying to think of a name. Now, I'm trying to think of a, an original name for this character that that both represents a rainbow and a fairy and passion fairy don't yeah. say fire rainbow don't passion. dare fucking say fire no i'm, please I'm not thinking of it i'm not gonna think of anything related to fire i think I, in all honesty i'd probably think of something that's more earth tone because that's more of your oh. element ellie it is my element i'm a virgo oh yes. you're earth i'm fire well i'm a gemini too so Let's see. that doesn't help so i'm also fire and water apparently <laughs> Your mud. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I think we've uh, we've. Been I mean, the if you're show. fire and water, then that makes steam. No, that's steam. Oh. I'm. I'm sorry. I misheard. I thought. Anyways, um, I think the uh, post show has gone on much longer than it needs to be. Right. <laughs> yeah. So, um, I'm gonna continue playing. Uh, I, I'm gonna have to. Uh, I am gonna backtrack with Pokemon and catch up to where I was. Um, the next time I play this game, I'll be confronted with Brock, and hopefully I can continue from there with no more lag, now that I know what I'm supposed to do. Apparently there were a few things that I forgot, and, well, by this point I now know what to do, so. I'll be catching yeah. you guys next, uh, so next week, um, I'm gonna be taking care of those <sighs> milestone goals, and, uh, the week after that, next, uh, the Alter and Friday, which will be two weeks from now, I'll continue Pokemon. So, I'll catch you guys later. Bye! Bye! Bye. Bye. Bye.